opera is based on a true story about three lighthouse keepers who, who went missing off a lighthouse in the Flatter Isles. The main act is about suggesting maybe what happened to them that night. And then the prologue is about the officers who are sent to the island to find out what happened to these lighthouse keepers. What Maxwell Davis does very well is you sort of come in when these guys are already, tensions are fraught. You know, it, it, there's no setup into the, the emotional state these guys are in. You know, it, it hits you almost immediately. It's, it's a soundscape like no other. It's an opera that, you know, even, even by contemporary operatic standards, the sounds and scrapes of the orchestra is something that, that is very unique to this opera. I started studying a lot of uh, early lighthouses and how they, how they used to throw light. And something I thought was really beautiful was the Fresnel lens, which is this beautifully shaped glass light. Because the idea being that the light is what's sending these men mad, as all because of them reacting to being in this lighthouse and being starved and just having the company of two other men that you probably don't really like very much. In the most heightened times in the piece, say where we're seeing ghosts or shadows or we're starting to freak each other out about what's happening, the music gets very edgy, very sharp, very angular. It's a mountain to climb in learning it, but when you get there, the payoff is huge. It, it is incredibly claustrophobic. It's, it's, an, it's an incredibly intense, um, musical and dramatic hour and 10 or hour and 15 minutes. It's a good night at the theatre.